A Japanese investment banker repeatedly raped a woman after slapping, punching and kicking her at his Marylebone flat. A court heard Takehiko Ojihara, 40, is accused of forcing himself on the woman during a horrific four-day ordeal, prosecutor Charlotte Newell said Ojihara. An executive director at Namuro International wanted to control the alleged victim, she told the court he ordered her to undress. Whilst remaining on the floor she was repeatedly bowing and apologizing, she described Ojihara as standing over her repeatedly slapping, punching and kicking her, Ms. Newell said, she asked him to stop, but he told her that she had harmed him, he pulled her to a standing position, turned her around and raped her forcefully, Blackfriars Crown Court today heard that the victim felt relieved when he finally stopped because she believed the ordeal was over, however when she asked to go to the bathroom Ojihara refused. Prosecution said she was told to urinate on the floor, Ms. Newell said. Jurors heard the victim made a note on her phone of the time and date of the alleged rapes over the four-day period and took pictures of her injuries. Ms. Newell said that the victim went to Paddington Green Police Station to report the mental and physical torture. When police arrested him he said, What, I cannot remember if I had with her, bespectacled and smartly dressed Ojihara. Sat in the dock today flanked by an interpreter as Ms. Newell opened the case for the prosecution, Ojihara, now living in Richmond, denies two counts of rape, two of while assault and one of assault occasioning actual bodily harm, Nomura. The largest retail financial holding company in Japan set up a base in London in 2009 after purchasing Lehman Brothers Asian and European operations the year before. The trial continues. Freaks out.